Sometimes within ArcGIS, you don't always have the layers that you want up on the screen, and you may want to remove or add new layers. In the case of this map, we want to take a look at tsunamis. We're going to use them in a query operation. To add tsunamis, what you want to do is, in this case, you would want to know where it's located. And in this case, it's within your, your uh, earthquakes folder. But it's just a matter of using the Add Data icon. So if you'll remember from the previous lab, you were adding data by adding a base map. You also added data from the ArcGIS Online site. This time we're going to add data right from the folder that you're using. I'm going to hit that. And within the Earth World Earthquakes folder, we see tsunamis. Before I add that, though, let's just take a look at this in the context of where it is. So we have our home folder established, but we also have something called folder connections. Folder connections is, in a previous tutorial, I showed you or I demonstrated in class how to establish a folder connection. This is where you would want to go if you weren't already located within that folder. So I'm going to go in there and I have my folder set up. I have one going all the way down into a weather class, but I'm going to go in here within my own folder and go into W Drive GIS data, 361 GIS, Geohazards, Earthquake Geology, and then World Earthquakes, and there it is. And now I'm going to go ahead and add it. Now after adding that, I might want to change that symbol into something a little different so it shows up. And I'll zoom out, and there we see some tsunami events that have occurred around the world. You're going to use that information to do a query operation, but that's how you would go ahead and add layers into a file.